Hello, my queens and my kings. Ooh. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Whatever time of the day it is that you have tuned in to yet another video from your girl, Just Treva. Uh, as you guys can tell, I have not uploaded a video, <clears throat> excuse me, since my sister's birthday. Um, actually, sorry, sorry, sorry. My sister's birthday was Friday, the 20th. Ugh, this is why lipstick, man. Anyway, and then I posted um, a little bit of my worship of the worship service, the start of service from Sunday. Um, to be totally, completely transparent because that's what I want from this vlog. Each and every vlog I give you, it may be boring, but it will be on. But from Sunday until about Tuesday, I could not talk. Tuesday night, I was able to actually talk to where people could hear me. But anyway, that led me to say that I didn't want a video there was nothing really to video, not to mention my mom's birthday is Christmas Day. And I will get more in depth with my parents and what happened and all that. Um, but they are no longer, they are deceased. Both my mom and dad have passed away. I was 10 going on 11 when my mom died and I was seven when my dad died. Me, um, to get out of the house, it's beautiful here in North Carolina. I think it's about 60 degrees. And I do have on this sweater. But that's because I don't I don't like wearing jackets. I don't like wearing coats or jackets. I have both coats and jackets, but they are only here for fashion purposes. They're not to keep me warm. They're just to add layers. Anyway, but if I can get away with not wearing a coat, I'm not wearing one. So this is a thick enough sweater. Walmart, these tights are from Walmart. These shoes that I have on that you saw me put on in the beginning are from Roses. They were $7.99. Um, I barely wear flats, but I decided to put some on today. Anyway, like I said, to get just get out of the house, get some fresh air. I am about to just, uh, I gotta get gas. Um, and then I might just walk around Walmart, uh, maybe go to Target. I hate Target. I don't like Target. But maybe go and be like the bougie people and go to tour again. I'm kidding. Y'all aren't bougie. Y'all aren't. Y'all know I love y'all. Those who shop at Target. I just don't shop at Target. Anyway, I love you guys. Thanks for rocking with me thus far. And I will be back. Still thinking about that scale. Oh, you guys, I got to do something. You guys, this is my problem. Like, I know the healthy things I'm supposed to eat. And I know that there is an equal balance for everything, you know? Like, eating just salads isn't always good either. You need the meats and the other things in that. But I'm just stuck in my ways, and I know that's what's killing me. You guys, like, right now, all I want to do is grab some chips and some queso and some Pepsi. That's all I want. And that's my problem. I snack a lot. 
Um, I will snack before I actually eat a full meal. Um, so I'm trying, you guys. I'm getting just some salad fixings for lunch. I'm not really, I'm not doing a big grocery haul. For one, I didn't make a list. Two, I'm hungry. Two things you should never do when you go to a grocery store. So, um, it's time to be real. Back home. Let's chat. I am back home, you guys. First off, 35 subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you for my 35. Thank you guys for rocking with me. Thank you for just helping to build me. Lord, oh, I was about to say, I was about to start praying. I was about to say, Lord God. <laughs> mm, see, come on now. I'm feeling that good. Um, let's just get some more zeros behind that, shall we? Um, tell your mama, tell your cousin, tell your friends, tell your coworkers, even the ones you don't like. Tell them there's a little chocolate thing on YouTube talking all this stuff. And she's funny and she's Treva, you know? Anyway, um, just to sim simply end this vlog, um... Again, I hope everyone had a great Christmas. It's only the day after Christmas, so you guys are probably still um, hanging with family and friends and all that good stuff, and I hope the best for everybody that's watching. Secondly, the scale. I have been through the ringer when it comes to weight, mainly because I never had to deal with my weight until I got, I'm 34, I started maybe dealing with my weight at 30. I never really worried about what I ate, what I did, my test results for my blood and organs and everything always turns out just fine. Um, it, like everything else, I it, there was never any signs to point to where I needed to look at my weight. But lately, I've been feeling so much pain in my stomach and in my midsection. I'm very short. I'm only five foot even. And all the weight that I gain sits in my stomach. So there's that. Um, when I saw the scale, this is actually day three of me looking at this scale. I'm not trying to get scared about what I see. But I got to start thinking realistically and I got to start somewhere, but that's the problem, you guys. I really have no idea. I really have no idea what I want to do right now. I see the number. I've never been at 160 something pounds. Um, I know some of the culprit. I know, I know some of the things that I'm eating and or drinking. Like I, I drink Pepsis all day. I snack, like I said in my video, in the video when I was in the grocery store, I snack, like I can sit here and snack all day, but won't eat a solid meal maybe once a day. So anyway, I know the things that are causing me to gain weight, but then I also know that this isn't a quick fix and I don't want it to be. I don't want to starve myself or only eat or drink water for weeks at a time. I don't, y'all, this journey... This is going to be a lifestyle change and I know it's going to be hard, but I cannot, I cannot go like I'm going now. I'm looking at myself in the mirror. I look at myself, disclaimer, TMI is about to happen in three, two, one. I look at myself naked all the time, mainly because I live by myself and I can, I walk around the house like that. Um, but I love, I love the human body. And I love, I think the human body is beautiful. And I look at myself mainly because it's my body and I want to see what she looks like. But lately, I've not been in love with my body. And that's got to change. I've never not been in love with my body and the way my clothes fit and the way I look good in certain things and the way certain things make me feel. Even those clothes don't make me feel good anymore. So, I, um... I got to figure this out, you guys. I got to figure it out. 
just prayers up for me. Um, I know the best way to start is to start. I know I go walking, you know, I just moved here. So I have been trying to walk and get my bearings as to where I am and get familiar with my, the area and everything else. So I know, I know what needs to happen. I just got to do it. Like I said, this isn't going to be easy because it took me years to create this mess. And so it's going to take time to recreate it. But I'm excited as to the journey for that as well. God is just showing up and showing out and I love him and I love what he's going to do. So I'm thanking him now in advance. I'm thanking you guys, my 35 subscribers. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I love you guys. Again, let's get that count up. Tell everybody. And also just always remember to love yourself and love and tell others that you love them too because you have no idea. We have no idea how many days we have left on this earth. All right, you guys. Thanks for rocking with me. Bye.